Hi guys, this is You Versus Them for October 31st through November the 8th. This reading is for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. If you guys are interested in a personal reading, please check out the website at pinkyurianjim.com. And um, this is, I'm going to use two decks for you guys. This one's going to be for you. This one's going to be for them. Uh, this is the Spellcaster's Tarot, and this one is the Steampunk Tarot. Okay, guys? Usually I don't really remember the names of decks unless I use them quite frequently. But um, the Spellcaster's is my favorite deck, and um, the Steampunk Tarot is my next favorite deck. All right, guys, so let's see how you felt about the relationship with this person. How you felt. How did Leo feel about the relationship with this person? How did Leo feel about the relationship with this person? Is that a star I thought up on the bottom of the deck? I felt like this was the one, quite possibly, for some of you. How did Leo feel about the relationship with this person? Two of Pentacles, you weren't really sure. I think you questioned whether this person was the one or not, okay? But regardless, I feel like you, you still tried to put them um, as a priority in your life, regardless of if you were sure about them. Capricorn energy there. How did this person feel about the relationship? How did this person feel about the relationship? <clears throat> How did this person feel about the relationship with Leo? The Empress. Hmm. They felt like it was everything. They felt like you guys were on a good path. Um, growing. Learning together. Doing things together. Planning to be together. This person felt like you guys had all of like the equipment to, to make this a long-lasting relationship here. This person really loved you. Um, they probably still do love you. They care about you a lot. I feel like this person would do anything for you. This is Taurus, Libra, Aries energy. <clears throat> What's currently happening for my Leo friends? What's currently happening for Leo? Seven of Pentacles. I see you guys waiting. I see you wondering. I, I see you like pondering on whether you wasted your time, uh, whether you should continue to invest waiting on this person to decide that they want to invest. Um, I see you guys like being single right now, but I don't, you're not sure about this connection still. So it's still present. It's still present here. Taurus energy. It's currently happening for the other person. It's currently happening for the other person. Okay. Queen of Cups. Hmm. Still very loving individual, still very caring. Um, I, I do feel like this person is still extending to you, even if you guys aren't together. I feel like the love is still very present for you guys here. Hmm. But I think this is somebody that is... Um, this person is very empathic. Um, and regardless if you're with them or not I feel like if you need them they'll be there for you yeah Cancer Scorpio Pisces energy what's influencing Leo situation currently what's influencing Leo situation currently oh three of swords a broken heart feelings of disappointment here some of you feel like this person has cheated on you. Even if they haven't cheated on you, um, this situation is very disappointing to you. I think because, you know, there's something that has happened between you guys in the recent past that I, th I think it kind of took you off guard with this person. And it was out of character for them. You weren't expecting this, whatever it is. Libra energy. What's influencing the situation with the other person? 
what's influencing the situation with the other person? That one wanted to come out. Then we have the Four of Pentacles, but it's in reverse. Huh. I think this person is just a, somebody that does not like to rock the boat. They like to get along with everyone. They do not like to hurt people's feelings. So I think that if they can help you, they'll help you, regardless if they're with you or not. Hmm. I feel like this person will definitely be willing to compromise with you, um, talk things through with you, and possibly even work things out with you guys if that's what you're looking for. I feel like they're letting go of, this person wants to let bygones be bygones is what I'm hearing. I also feel like they give of themselves um, very selflessly, like as far as their material goods are concerned, like their money, um, their food, I mean, just anything. Like this person does not place a lot of value on material things. And so this is the type of person I feel like will give you their last if they felt like you needed it more than they did. I know they kind of sound saintly, but I don't think they're saintly. I just feel like um, this person may have a hard exterior, but then when you get to know them, you realize that they're a softy, but they're not so soft to where they will let you take advantage of them. You know what I'm saying? Um, I think a lot of people get them they get it twisted when it comes to this person. This person is almost like a chameleon too. Because I feel like they have a hard exterior, but they're really soft inside. They'll give you their heart. But if they feel like you're taking advantage of them, then they will stop it dead in its tracks. Is how I'm feeling here. <clears throat> What's coming in for Leo? What's coming in for Leo? Capricorn energy. Again, it's present. It's coming in for Leo. Eight of Swords. Mm, three of Swords with the Eight of Swords. You guys are having a hard time moving past something that happened. It's the bottom line. Something that transpired between the two of you has really, you know, got you stuck in this miserable place mentally. It's just got you stuck. You want so very badly to like, you know, let go of it and get out of this this horrible um, pile of shit. Is what I'm feeling. But yeah, what did they do? What did they do? Did they flip the script on you? Did you misread them? Did they cheat on you? Were they? with someone else because when I look at the four of pentacles you know four of pentacles is about saving and holding on to not only money but holding on to situations and people but when you go back from the four of pentacles that's a three of pentacles and that's falling under the three of swords so did they decide to work it out with someone else and that's what's really got you you know really upset about the situation and feeling disappointed and um and, and possibly you know having been deceived by them in some way like they were giving to another situation here mm -hmm. let's see what's coming in for them because it's something that's got you guys feeling like how could they it's coming in for the other person Two of Cups. Cancer energy. Hmm. Maybe the fact that this person has gotten involved with someone. And you feel like they betrayed your trust, betrayed you. You thought what you had was more than how this person is treating it. And moving on. But I, I do sense a relationship or some sort of connection for them, um, you know, on the horizon. <clears throat> what is the 
outcome here for Leo's? What is the outcome for Leo's? Oh, the Empress. That could be you. That could be you with that Two of Cups. Look at here. You have the Empress on the end. And here they are as the Empress. You guys could definitely be getting back together. This could definitely be them trying to work things out with you here. A lot of you guys may be Cancer Leo Cuspers. A new start. The person that you feel like embodies everything that you want in a person. Being in the outcome for you. Taurus, Libra, Aries energy there. What is the outcome here? Oh, that one wanted to jump. I'm going to take it. Page of Pentacles. Hmm. Maybe this is this person taking a step towards you. The Page of Pentacles. Learning something new about themselves and learning something new about you. Something that they didn't know before. Mm hmm Apologizing, even, with the Page of Pentacles energy here. Realizing that there is definitely something, something here. Something that's not fleeting. You know, pages are the beginnings of something. They're, they don't jump into things like with both feet, but they definitely, you know, keep an eye out and are looking for ways to, you know, advance their situation. And I feel like with the pentacles here, page of pentacles, this is something very substantial. For sure. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy. Okay, so that's what I have for you guys, and I'll be speaking with you soon. Bye now.